Welcome back, everybody. We're here to pull cards for February the 26th. We're just a little craziness happen. I hope the whole day isn't going to end up like that. We had a crazy day like this a couple of days ago. Anyway, February 26th, the first thing I'm going to pull is overall energy. It may be in your best interest to take a peek and see what that overall energy is about before you zoom on to your sign or your rising sign or your friend's signs and rising signs. Let's take a peek and see what is showing up for overall energy. What do we have here? Four of Wands coming up in reverse. Okay. So this to me is talking about the idea of going away from home, coming out of the nest. If you have a home base, being away from that home base. It is also a card that generally is a very temporary being away type of situation. So it's traveling for business or traveling for pleasure or sometimes it's even a breakup, but it's a breakup that's not going to be broken up forever when this card indicates it. Okay, you may not know that when it first happens. The tarot does. That's why it brings up this card. I should say Sacred Spirit does. Sacred Spirit uses the cards to talk to me. La da da. Part of our psychic language. Aries. Nine of chalices showing up in reverse. This is just telling me that you're taking some kind of trip away from home or home base today and it's not bringing you very much satisfaction or happiness. Definitely not meeting your expectations for the day. Okay. Taurus. Taurus. Star card showing up here. This talks about the idea of being away from home as a very healing situation for you. Very healing and very hopeful. So we like that. Gemini. King of Chalices. This just tells me that whatever you're doing away from home or home base, you're really enjoying it. It feels peaceful and good and wholesome to you. And let's see, that was Gemini, right? Yep. Next we're looking at Cancer. Boop, buddy, doop. Boop, King of Pentacles. Didn't we just have a king? Look at that. Two kings. Okay, Cancer, King of Pentacles. I think that this time away from home or away from your home base is going to be very lucrative for you. Lucrative, profitable, whatever word you want to put there. Next up, we're going to take a peek at Leo's. Leo, Leo, Leo. King of Wands showing up in reverse. There's something about this time away from home or home base that you're not really, you haven't exactly figured out how it's supposed to go yet. You're still kind of working around that. Next up, Virgo. What do we have? Three of Wands showing up for Virgos. Well, that makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> away from home, Three of Wands, traveling. You may be making travel plans today too. Um, for longer term travel, you may be away from home in a place that you realize, oh, I want to spend some more time in this place. So that could very easily be going on for you. Or was that was that Libra yet? Nope, just Virgo. Libra, Libra, Libra. Okay, Knave of Pentacles showing up in reverse. Libra, your considerations about being away from home or home base. Uh, I think that you're recognizing today that those are ideas that are going to bring you less money instead of more money. May even be kind of tight on money. Scorpio. Make sure there's only one card there. Six of Swords. Living, you know, going away from home to find some peacefulness. Some peacefulness, maybe even some isolation and peacefulness. All right, next up we're looking at Sagittarius. Eight of Wands. Sagittarius, today I think you've got a lot of communication coming up here. And that communication, excuse me, sorry about that. Forgot to silence my phone. Anyway, that communication about being away from home or home base is what's showing up as the theme for you guys today. 
much more so than actually being away from home or home base. Although for some of you, this communication could be happening away from home or home base. Boop -a -doo -doo. Some of you, it even could happen online. Capricorn, 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 Five of Wands coming up in reverse. Talks about the idea of getting away from any kind of competition. So being away from home or home base to try to uh, bring some calmness, some non-competitive energy into your vibes. Next up, we're looking at Aquarius. Ace of Swords showing up here for Aquarius in reverse. Ace of Swords in reverse. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I think you're passing along some good advice to somebody about the idea of being away from home or home base. So you could have somebody visiting a place that you have visited before and you have good ideas about the wardrobe to pass along or something like that very easily. All right, that was Aquarius. Now we're looking at Pisces. Okay, Pisces, Knave of Swords. Boop -ba -doo 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 -doo. I think you're getting in some kind of information about the idea of being away from home or away from home base. For some of you, this is going to be information that allows you to be away from home or home base that much more easily soon. Uh, for others of you, this is going to be information about being away from home or home base uh, that happened in the past, and now you're finding out about something regarding that situation. Hmm. Okay, so that's what I've got for today, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I do appreciate it. Remember to put a thumbs up on the video, share it with others, and put comments down below. That all helps the logarithm. And of course, I'm looking forward to reading for some of you a little bit later on, either on the phone or online. And the rest of you, I'll see you back on the next video. Peace out.